Please. Is there anyone else will help me. Hello. <laughs> Absolutely nobody. It's Sparrow up here. Uh, welcome back. Episode three of Horizons Zero Dawn. Um, or Horizon Zero Dawn, probably. Um, I need your help. Yeah, shut up. There's things coming. So in the last episode, we um. Oh, see, that's not going to go down well. I haven't got any ammo. Um, that's going to rub some stuff in here. Give me a break. Hey! Ah. Oh. It's not very nice of you doing that to me. Oh, right, that's it. Melee. <laughs> oh my goodness. Might need to heal. Oh! <laughs> For goodness sake. <laughs> I didn't even get to finish my intro. So hello, it's Fat up here. <laughs> Welcome back. Horizon Zero Dawn uh, episode I'm injured. three. I need your help. All right, shut up, Thor. If that if that's what your name says, I didn't actually read it. Um, yeah. So in the last episode, Could you not help me. You, if you speak again, I'm gonna shoot you in the head. Please. No one else will help me. Thor. Right, we're gonna go and speak to him in a minute. But in the last episode, we got Gratta a uh, uh, prayer Please, beads back, and we managed to get enough um, bits and pieces to create these little arrows here. So in this episode, the idea is what we're going to do is we're going to head down here and speak to Cask, Cast, and um, trade for a trip caster. Please, a word. You do my, you do my head in. What do you want? I'm an outcast. You're not supposed to speak to me. You want to talk to an outcast? I'm desperate for help. Whatever the consequences. What's the problem then? Trouble with your leg? Forget about me. It's my daughter, Arana. She's in danger. Oh, she went after a scrapper near Mother's Cradle. And I fear for her life. I can't even stand up, let alone go after her. Will you help me find her? Oh, for goodness sake. Why would your daughter hunt a scrapper on her own? It's my fault. I went after it first and it tore up my leg. I barely got away and I left a spear impaled in the machine. That spear was made by Adina, my mate, who died last year. Oh dear. It means everything to Arana. She, she went after the scrapper to get it back. Oh, for goodness sake. Uh, fine. I'll do what I can to help your daughter. Make sure she's all right. I'm begging you. All right, sideshow Bob. My goodness, no one, can, no one can help themselves in this game. Right. <sighs> I, even in Seven Days to Die, I start an episode, and I get distracted straight away. So quests, right? Side quests. Uh, what's this one? So we, we, that's the one we, that we saw in the last one, where there's blood all over this guy's this guy's camp, and he wants us to go and have a look. And this one here is to go and um, find that. It's, this one's only 168 steps away, so we'll have a look at this one. Um, so that's got that is what we're doing, isn't it? So yeah, so we'll go and have a look at this one. We've got the campfire done. We'll pick up some of these bits and pieces before um, we go just to fill up a medical box because we have just used a little bit um, yeah so in the last episode we ended it up on that cliff up there but um, I wasn't sure whether or not if I logged off it would save my progress so I came down to the nearest campfire which is there and that's where I can be started um, and it does seem like if you if you light one of those campfires it's a quick save so then you can just log off and on again and it brings you back in exactly the same place which is cool. Just gonna gather some more wood. Um, so, <clears throat> so far, I am very impressed with this Here, game. I can use this. She can use this. Good. I'm glad about that. 
Um, the graphics are fantastic. The, the the picture mode is a lot of fun. You can go, in, you can take yourself into picture mode and have a look around, and it's you know, it's a good game. Must be Alana. Sounds like she's in trouble. So far, anyway, and it looks like there's some good side missions. Um, how do you? Help! Oh, goodness sake! Oh yeah, you can swim. You can swim under water. Where are you? Right, so those things... Oh, is that her there? Right, that's cool. So she's not in too much trouble. So we can get ourselves into cover. There's only a couple of them, so we should be able to take them down if we're sneaky about it. We can get a stealth kill. Stealth kill. Oh, I didn't really get anything we wanted there. You have to shoot them in the face for a stealth kill. Yeah. And this one. You want to turn around and look at me? Haha. <laughs> yeah. Oh god. There we go. I'm getting used to your stupid attacks. Take that! I think I took a bit of damage there, but that was <laughs> that was that was a lot of fun. So it is a little, you know, it is a stealth game basically. I don't think you can take these guys on head to head. Um, I need to really find out as well what can all I these things I'm collecting. So, you know, for 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 being an outcast, everyone wants to talk to me. Where are you? There you are. Hello. Thank you. I thought those watchers were going to tear me apart. You up a Your tree. Your father sent me after you. It's time to go home. I figured. But I can't go back until I get my mother's spear from that scrapper. Oh, of course you can't. <sighs> right, okay. I'll look for your spear. You will? Oh, thank you. Go find your father. His leg gave out while he was searching for you, just south of Mother's Heart. Oh, no. Okay, I'll go to him right away. Thanks again. Yeah, I'll get your stupid spear back. Don't worry. I'll gather that root since I'm standing here. Right, okay. Investigate the area for the um, with your focus. Uh, press R1. Which one's R1? That one. Highlight tracks. Is this it here? What is that? That that was freaky. What is that? Um, follow the tracks. Did I highlight the tracks? Oh god, I should read the instructions really, shouldn't I? Highlight the tracks. Oh, there you go. We can follow them. Then. Right, so here we go. That's a freaky little kind of ghost thing you walk past. Now I remember these scrappers, they are an absolute beast. So we're going to need to be careful when we're doing this. Um, up here then. Especially if we're going to run into other things that are, that are uh, mean to me as well. Like these things here. I think that's um, one of those watchers. The thing is, if you get them in the face straight away, they're um, relatively good, relatively easy to take down. I'm just going to ignore them, because I think I can probably get away with not attacking them. So we'll head this way. Rana's trail ends here. Must be where she saw the scrapper. Okay. If I follow its tracks, I should be able to find that spear. Right, so there's another, some more tracks. Select them. There's a dude up here just standing there. What are you? What on earth are you doing? Okay, let's keep going. I do like I do like the idea of this game, and I, you know the gameplay is really good, and I like the graphics, and I like the fact that you've got this little you've got this little um, headpiece that kind of highlights things like this. It's fantastic. Really, really fantastic game so far. Um, I can see why the uh, the you know the gaming magazines were given a ten out of ten. 
There is a way you can slide. Oh, there you go. There's a slide. It's just I'm not really keen on taking down this scrapper right now, to be honest. The trail ends here. I'll bet it crossed the river. Yeah. Better check the other side. Okay. Well, there you go. You can see it starts there. So we'll um, we'll go through the river then. Not deep enough to swim in. Right, highlight the track. How do I do that again? Highlight the track. Where did I find it? There it is. Come out. Yes, that's brilliant. Can I take that? Time to see Karst and get a trip caster. Yeah, yeah, we'll do that in a minute, don't worry. We're helping our fellow um, human beings. Oh god, there's something looking at me. I thought that noise meant something was looking at me. What is that? Some terrifying things are just kicking around here. Um, I'll take whatever you are, though. Because we don't actually have anything in our med pack right now, so that's probably not a good thing, considering we're about to go into a battle with something I know will kick my ass left, right, and centre. Uh, there's a campfire, which is good. I'm going to leg it across here quick. Do the quick save on the campfire. So when, <laughs> so when we die, this is where we're going to come back. I wonder if this is taking me in the direction of where I want to go. Yeah, because I think I think the um, the area you want to go down here for the tripcaster is down here. So, you know, at least at least the side missions sending is in the right kind of direction, uh, which is helpful. I just hope we find it dead. Here. Time to get that spear. Is that it up there? Alright, let's get into the um the bushes. Is that long grass we can hide in? Yeah, there you go. Can I throw a rock to get its attention? Yeah, come over here. Come over here and put your pretty little face out. I don't know what the weaknesses are on this thing. <laughs> right, I'm gonna need to build some more. Um, I need to build some more arrows, really. That music is very ominous. Okay, so we're gonna have to climb up here then. Are we gonna have to climb up here? Where are we gonna have to climb up then? How do I get up here? They must. How do I climb? Oh, come on! Oh, there you go. Oh. Like that. What is going on here? I don't think that's really going to hide me very well, is it? But right, I think there's the one with a spear in it. We need to have a look to see what the sweetnesses are. The yellow areas. I thought you were meant to give me some kind of... Ah, oh, you little madam! Is Melly going to do any good for me here? <laughs> Let's just take all the stuff from there and get out of here quick. <laughs> Tell you what though, I need to run a bit quicker. Out of here, man. Yeah, okay. So there you go. So, right. I think I might need to heal. Oh, we had full health. I thought we had no health for a minute there. Um, right, so before I head on up that way, because that's just going to take us all the way back up here to, to where that dude was lying down, I think we can change quests, go into our main one and highlight the fact that we need to go and get this trip caster because I think that was quite close to where we are um, yeah so it's on the way back now it's on the way back anyway so fantastic so we can head that way now and then I think once I've got that 
We'll make, we'll make a nice little short episode of this one because I know the last ones have been plus 40 minutes and that gets quite long. Um, so we'll go and get this trip caster. I'm sure there's going to be something we have to do for it. But we're not just going to be able to rock up and pick one up. No one else around. Looks safe to meet. Okay. My guess is he'll be waiting. There he is. Looks nervous. Hello. Well, well, well. An outcast on my doorstep. All mother protect me. Surprised you saw me the way you keep looking every other direction to make sure no one's watching. Careful there, or you'll sprain your neck. It's always a pain in the neck when you show up, girl, one way or another. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. Okay. Is Let's there a that. reason why you're acting so cranky today? Once you run the proving and get made a brave, you'll deal with traitors in mother's heart. Uh, Maybe I don't like losing customers. Traitors who don't break the law and deal with outcasts, you mean? That's right. Our days of crime will be behind us. He so reminds me of somebody. Keep quiet. An actor. Are you worried I'm going to tell someone that you trade with outcasts? I don't think you're the kind who talks. But you never know. You can stop worrying. The secret's safe with me. I'm sure it is. Yeah, that's what I figured. But I don't mind hearing it. Why do you take the risk? Trading with outcasts? Why do you take Every the risk? Every time you ask. If a big, meaningful talk is what you're after, move along. It's because you used to be one, isn't it? Yeah. Got caught poking around one of the metal ruins out beyond the embrace. Matriarch said I was tainted and gave me five years. What did you see in the ruins? Nothing I can make sense of. After my shunning, I tried living back in Mother's heart, but everyone I knew had moved on, and there were so many people everywhere I turned. I like it better out here. Yeah, I don't blame you. The only person I've ever told about our trades is Rost. Yeah, well, not like he can turn me in, even if he wanted to. Law and duty sort of a man, that Rost. I don't know how you stand it. You really don't know why he was cast out? I've told you no. I don't think anyone knows what he did, but it must have been serious because his term is for life. I'd be interested to know. I see a Last trade. time I visited, you had a trip caster available for trade. Still got it? I do. But you'd need to bring me a scrapper lens. What can I say? Special weapons don't come cheap. Tell me I've got one. Oh, I can pay. Took down a scrapper not long ago. Stripped out the lens in perfect condition. I'll be the judge of that. Show me. Get in. Get in. Um. Sell. Weapons, outfits, modif modifications? I don't know. How do I do this? I don't know what's what. That's not it. That's not it. That's not it. Resources. What was he looking for again? Strider lens. I thought you said you had one of these. Watcher lens. Your heart. So it was a scrapper lens, wasn't it? Um. Okay. Modifications. Damaged coil. Don't like. Don't tell me you've got something that don't actually have it. I'm just going to give him that then. Uh, bye. Trip cast. Alright, oh, so I don't have it. You told... You just said you had one! Maybe I do. Oh. Choose a slot. Let's go for up. Got yourself a trip okay. caster. Practice how to use it someplace else, alright? 
My life's exciting enough without a bunch of shock wire booby traps to trip over. <laughs> really? Could have fooled me. <laughs> All right, anything else? <laughs> Let's have a look. Will you be around later in case I want to make another trade? I'll be here. Same as usual, bring me the parts you harvest from any machines you hunt. The better the parts, the more shards I'll pay. Be sure to take a close look at my inventory, though. Who knows? Maybe I've got something that could give you an edge in the proving. Alright. Let's have a quick look through the inventory, and I think I am going to call this episode an end. Um, I know it's not been so long, but, you know. Sling. Buy. Sling. Uh, the slow-firing sling lob. Elemental bombs on a large area, blah blah blah, I'm not interested in that. Rope caster. Used to tie down machines, that's quite cool. Um, I think I've got one of them. Weapons. Oh no, I haven't. So this is a lightweight bow. Value 50, handling 80. What's the, what's the one he's got? Uh, war bow. Metal shards, not enough anyway. Um, anyway, so, I'm gonna. Anything else? I'm gonna spend a little bit of time looking through the inventory and doing a little bit of kind of. I suppose just looking at the systems to see if I can figure out how to do anything. But I'm gonna call that one an end. So that's an, um, a nice end to episode three. I think we've got ourselves a trip caster. So in the next episode, we'll head on back to Rost and we'll find out what he's got planned in the area we haven't been to yet, which should be quite cool. So um, I'm going to thank you for watching. So, um, you know, please do subscribe if you're not subscribed. Um, I'm trying to release one of these every day, um, along with my 7 Days to Die videos. So, um, you know, if you're into 7 Days to Die or Horizon, um, please do subscribe and follow me. So thank you very much for watching, and I will speak to you all very soon. Okay, take care. Bye now.